Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to my fourth video tutorial on chat room using Firebase database. So in this video I will show you how to create uh, a chat room and how uh, to uh, create the layout file for the chat room and then how to append the messages or how to show the messages all right to the user. So let's get started. As you guys know, I have uh, previously built the app uh, in my previous videos. So first of all, I would request you to please subscribe to my channel. I will be uh, uploading a lot more videos on Firebase and Android app development. All right. So first of all, what we need to do is we need to create another layout or activity. So I will write activity, empty activity. All right, and I will name it as chat room activity. All right. So now in here, let me raise that, and let me select a theme. So now here, what we will do is we will just paste the code. Alright, so here what we are doing is, alright, let me create the layout on my own so that you know how to create the layout. So I will write a small button here, send, and I will take an edit text. alright now what I need is a scroll view and in scroll view I need a text view So for that I will create the text view inside So I will create a text view here Wrap content, wrap content I will write text. Let me see if it is inside our scroll view. So now it's in our scroll view. Alright, so we will just erase that text. We will just specify the ID. Messages text. Alright, so now what we need here is first of all we have to go to our main activity and in here as you guys know uh, in our main activity the uh, chat rooms will be displayed alright in a list view so if uh, so when the user click on an uh, on a chat room so the chat room window should be opened all right that specific chat room window so f what we will do is uh, go to go here and in here write l limit is l1 yes l1 dot set on item click listener on item click listener all right so here we will open our chat room activity so I, so I will write intent i equals to new intent main activity dot this and chat room activity dot class 
I will rename it as intent and I will write intent dot put extra and in that put extra what we will write is chair to first of all uh, room name so here we will write text view I am getting the error so the error was I had to use now dot get text and dot to string and now there is still, still an error that yeah this is our own create method set on item click this node view on set item click this node intent intent this is to new intent main activity dot delay this Check room activity dot class intent dot put extra room name and I will text view dot get text dot to string intent dot put extra username name all right and start activity intent so uh, this chat room will be activate uh, opened so here we, uh, we will we will initialize this view So we will just initialize it. Now we need to initialize the edit text. So we will write edit text two, and we also need to initialize the text view. right so what we need here 
is the database reference file base database reference reference and we will initialize it reference is equal to file base database dot get instance dot get reference dot child all right so uh, as you guys know we have sent room name and uh, username so we will just write uh, first of all let me initialize user name and room name so the first is the room name so what we will do is room name equals to get intent dot get extras dot get so we will write room name dot two string similarly username equals to get intent dot get extras dot get room name and user name dot to string all right so we will write here the room name all right because we have to insert the messages in our room name so the next step is uh, we need to first of all set if get support action bar is not equal to null set support action bar set display home and get support set show home enabled true and we will also write implement the method on options item selected so here what we will write is if item dot get item id equals to android dot r dot id dot home finish all right so now what we need is the reference so we will write reference dot at child even listener new child even listener so we will write a method here in on child edit so where is the error all right so we need to write append chat and we will pass the data snapshot similarly on child change and on child moved so we will uh, we will write the method so let's say we will say public void append chat data snapshot data snapshot all right so now here what we will do is first of all we will initialize our strings username and room name all right so we need and we need an a creator a creator 
i equals to data snapshot dot get children dot iterator and so now we will write a while loop while i dot has next as the uh, first index will be stored in i so we will write uh, chat username equals to data snapshot i dot next dot get value dot to string all right so similarly we will write room name equals to this will be the second index alright so what we will now do is we will just write t1.append and first of all we will write the username plus username string plus next line so we will just initialize them here user and room so we will write user and room so we will write user all right so in this video i wish i have uh, just built the chat room activity so that the chat rooms are shown here so if you like the video please subscribe to my channel and wait for the next video goodbye